And best, maybe best Kirby. Maybe. Yeah, uh, Gilhu. Gilhu is really good. Yeah, Hammer yeah. Jaja is really really good. Yeah. Oh, pretty good. But yeah, I I, I know the U.S. Uh, the U.S. and Me it's it's always a war between uh, Mexico, the U.S. and Japan. Who's right. the best? Uh, who's the best region? But right now we're seeing a very interesting match against Turbograph and you know Goblin. Now Goblin has to avenge his uh, his fallen buddy. Moist Cola is in losers from an early pools upset. Mm -hmm. His fellow Roy brethren. Hopefully, for his own sake, he does not see the same fate. Goblin, though, no stranger to the big stage, no stranger to playing with big crowds. And he's a very in-your-face, high-pressure, high-octane right. player. He just never stops moving. He's, he ghost busts all the time mm -hmm. and swings for the trees every single time. And that's exactly what we're seeing. Like, um, Fantasia is just trying to look at the options, like just trying to make some space, right? But Goblin, Goblin's never gonna let you. So you have to be like super careful, you have to be super defensive to be actually able to take the first stock against, because like you said, he's a very explosive player. Like, he's sucio. Right. He's a, he's sucio, man. Sucio. sucio. Filthy. Filthy. Down throw. Oh, I'm liking Turbo Graph though, actually. Oh. You know, you, you, you watch these. Oh my God, the read from Goblin. That raw forward smash was so good. They really, if it's one thing that they wanted to make sure in Ultimate is that good forward smashes are really, really good. Really, really good. Yeah, that's correct. Forty-nine percent just of one string, just uh, making Fantasia uh, take a second on the ledge just to be able to breathe after so uh, after that pressure. To okay, neutral B just trying to get the uh, just trying to get the bombs, the, the sensor bombs right wow. in front of Goblin's face, but Goblin's not taking any of it. He knows how to play. Oh my God, that was an. Oh, oh, oh. Might actually go up B again. I love how he can. Uh, I love how how he goes for the defensive option. As as soon as he sees you jump, he's not he's not gonna doubt any moment. Just the, the just up B, bro. Right. And the thing that the thing, what the top Samus players do, the really best Samus is, they make it so ambiguous. Right. What they're gonna go for with one jump. They can just like B Ooh. reverse bomb. Ooh. They can do for Zare, little falling up air. There's a lot. Samus has a lot of time to decide an option to make you confused. And I think the problem is, Goblin is just. You know, able to predict pretty straightforward the flow chart that Fantasia is offering. Has to do some more mix-ups, and right now, three stock 158 should die for this up throw. He does. Ooh. Yeah, 177 enough to be able to t uh, take off the first stock. Just waiting on the, uh, just waiting on the on the shield. He knows Roy can actually get that much damage uh, on early on an early stock, like on a really healthy stock. So it's a really good option uh, if you're a really floaty character. Then just go for it. Oh, just missing by a single pixel. The up, the up be out of shield of, uh, you know. It was good for him that he, he got, didn't get punished. Again, for the second one, 30%. Oh, just going for the side B. Super good. Again, just juggling really hard for Tasha. He needs to land immediately because he's already on the verge of the first, first match. Yep. Another down throw following. There's an up air. Oh. Yeah. Turbograph is really not finding too many answers against Goblin's ridiculously fast style. Yeah. And one of those fairs or downers is going to hit. Maybe a jab back here. Classic finisher he does. Staying central stage. Want to go? Yeah. He's going for it. Oh, the fair just <laughs> barely, barely escaping that. Just charging the the, the down bees. Just trying to get it. Oh yeah. no! I, I think right there, if you're Samus, especially from a deficit, go for a risky edge guard. You yeah. Well, you're down, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like right here, maybe go for a dunk. Forward tilt, okay. That's, that's good. Just being able to keep him on watch. Oh, Ooh, that like was that. That, that might have killed actually. That was a really good option, but you know, again, Goblin just being able to guess everything that Fantasia is putting on the table. First game, and Goblin seems really consistent on how he's playing Roy. Um, so aggressive, like. So, like, I'm seeing a way calmer. Like, I know Goblin is like a super. You know, high risk play, but since since he was on Mexico, I'm seeing like a, a he's paced down and he's not taking uh, like the biggest risky options. It it could be probably because he's just like impulse. Yeah. But I know the guy learned a thing or two. One thing one thing I'm noticing with Goblin uh, actually with Roy, remember I'm gonna mention slingshotting again. Uh -huh. He's yeah. actually landing a few in that match. Uh, probably doing it to not get hit by an out of shot option or a grab. I saw a couple. Um, but yeah, it's really making a difference. If you can, if it, if it helps win one more neutral interaction than he would have lost. Right. Like, oh, that's a new time. 
I'm really, I'm really happy to see um, for the new, uh, for the you know next three months how the the tier list is gonna change just because of a slingshot. Right. So I feel like it opened up like a lot of options for uh, uh, you know characters that were already really good in mov movement, but it just opened up a win uh, a window of opportunity for the characters that were considered mid to uh, mid to low tier. So I really want to see like more characters like Samus and you know. Stuff like that, just doing a lot more slingshots. Yeah. Speaking of window opportunity, oh. perfect percent there to kill off the side. Goblin will take a quick stalk with a dancing blade. And finally, Fantasia finds the charge shot. Grab, down throw, fair, bread and butter. Two bombs on the side. Goblin taking all the hits, actually. Already at 86. 101 might actually have a chance for a stalk here. Doesn't go for the pivot grab. Give me a big punish here for that missed up beat. 28 for turbo grab. Oh. Making sure he gets a little bit of charge when he comes back. Stock should be his. Ooh. Okay, he no punish. No, no punish. No punish. Just trying to get as much damage as, as he can. Over 100%. Just, ooh, the parry so good. Nair just to get a fair conversion. 58. Going for the down air. No, he's not going for it. Dash attack. Ooh, let's see what the conversion is. Great, waiting the on the shield. So patient. Yep. Okay. Good up B. Yeah, and now it's the game of footies, right? Go for the oh. same kill option again. Yep. Almost there. Look, he would have died 78. Going for the no tag either. No tag. He's going to be yeah. make it. No, the first is going to be able to take the second stock. And Goblin seems really good on this yeah. match. Like, I feel like he's just waiting to get a trade and not risk anything. You got to attack those. And also, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be on, on production's butt all day for this. Got to make sure. It's 1-0 Goblin right now. <laughs> that happened yesterday, too. <laughs> yeah. Update the score, my friends. Oop. All right, bomb the side. Look at that. And up e, so much priority. It's supposed to be so, so many much priority. things. Most yep. projectiles. I think maybe yep. all. I mean, you. I wonder if it's up e beats Steve Minecart. I mean, you do have iframes, like, in between the, the, the animations. So it's a really safe option against, uh, you know, certain characters. But hey, 94 against uh, 100. Uh, oh, oh, is he going to take it? it is. Oh, my God. Is it On Gob. Wow. On Gob. That's my man. That's the CFL. Two, two, oh. And yo, um, I'm seeing the chat. They're saying Cole is out. What do you mean he's out? Like, out of a tournament. Is he? No, Cole, I know Cola lost winners for sure. Right, because I was, because that was upset. The, the, the thing with Twitch chat sometimes is that they're not always honest. Yeah. Believe it or not, I saw <laughs> one occasion about two weeks ago where someone in my chat was lying about something. Oh my god. That's the first time <laughs> I've ever seen that. So, you gotta be careful. The brackets are there. Um, I think he's in losers going on a run right now. So, and I'd be surprised. It, it, it's one thing for someone to get upset.